Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's video. Today I am bringing you what's new in my wardrobe. I have been adding a few pieces here and there for my summer capsule wardrobe and I have all of them here to share with you guys. Now I am a strong believer in the term of sell to buy. So anytime I replace or add anything to my wardrobe, more than likely I either gave some pieces to charity, family, or I sold it on. If this is your first time here, my name is Vilma. I'm super happy that you were able to tune in. I do one video a week related to fashion and lifestyle. If you like the sound of that, I would absolutely love after you watch this video that you subscribe to my channel along with my social media platform and all the links will be listed below in the info bar for you guys. So the pieces that I'm going to show you today are going to be from a few different stores. It's not going to be the taste of everybody, but that is the beauty of having your own personal style. And I feel like for 2021, I have really, really been drawn to more simple pieces that don't have a lot going on. And the reason for that is because I like pieces that are a little bit understated, but after adding maybe a nice pair of sandals or a bag or even a hat, it truly elevates that piece, meaning that I can wear it for years and years to come. Without further ado, let's get started with this video. So the first brand that I want to talk to you guys about is going to be Cause because I'm very new to it and I feel like a lot of you may also be new to this particular brand. I love their dresses, the simplicity and how much they can be elevated to the next level, although they're very, very understated pieces. So I have at least three dresses here from them that I want to share with you guys. The first one is going to be a t-shirt dress and I have it in this gorgeous beige shade. It's very simple. There's really not much to it, but that is the beauty of this dress in my opinion. So I got it in size small. It retails for 55 pounds and it's made of, I believe 99% cotton and a little bit of elastane because it does have a slight stretch to it. It comes with slits on the side. There's a little bit more movement to the dress. And like I said, a piece like this, although it's very simple, you can definitely change it with some accessories or even by adding a belt. I adore it and I liked it so much that I decided to get it in a different shade which is this one right here. Now as I mentioned it comes in four available shades. The beige, this teal shade, black and pink and the pink one is very very beautiful and I think it would suit darker skin tone so well or somebody with blonder hair. I think it would look stunning but I decided to go for the teal because I wanted to add a little bit of color to my wardrobe but nothing that was too much out there and I feel like for example this would look really nice with a black belt so darker accessories but it also looks beautiful with brown as well. So my next piece from Cause is a another dress. So this one is a tube rib knit dress made of 100% organic cotton. It comes in this really lovely dark gray shade, but it also comes in a more brighter shade. I think it's kind of like a yellowish or bright lemon shade, which is beautiful for summer. But of course, that shade for me would be too much. I decided to go for the basic gray. So this has a racer back, but it's not too small. And I got it in size medium. Really love how it fits, the feel of the cotton. And by the way, I have already worn these. I've washed them, they wash really well. And for 30 pounds from this particular store, I actually think it's a great price because cost dresses can be a little bit above that. It could have been very easily uh, placed at a price of, I don't know, maybe 40 pounds. But I think for an organic cotton made dress, I think the price is actually on point and I really love it. Next, I have a piece from Weekday. And if you're not familiar with Weekday, Weekday is from the family group from H&M, Arquette. Um, and it's for a more, I would say maybe younger audience per se, but they have pieces there that somebody like me, like you, could definitely benefit from buying because they're not super expensive and you can find really good uh, fabrics available in their store. So I have one tank top and this is kind of like a racer 
back as well top this is made of 100% cotton and it's made of a rib knit material now I already have this in a different shade which is black but it comes in many many different shades it retails for eight pounds i believe also the cotton is actually organic the cotton that they use to create these and like i said they come in many many different shades it's very basic but you can wear this with linen trousers like the ones that i have right here or with jeans um a skirt it's a piece that in the summer is perfect to have for those warm days um, if you're smaller in the top section you can actually get away with not wearing a bra i still wear a bra with this but i wear a racer back bra um, which is from a brand that i'm going to talk about today as well but yeah really love this and for the price bargain so the next store that i'm going to talk about it's not going to come as a surprise it's going to be our kit but i only have two pieces that i want to talk about so the piece that i'm going to show you first i've mentioned it before in my our kit uh, one brand review which is this 100% silk cami it's something that i wanted to buy for a very very long time but i was waiting to find the right one at the right price as well because 100% silk can be a little bit more expensive so this is a very basic cami um, it's a little bit wider which i find very flattering so it can fall a little bit better it retailed i believe full price for around 55 or 60 pounds but i paid less i think as far as i can remember i paid less than 20 pounds for it it's still available it's on promotion i saw it in the store just the other day not entirely sure if i'm going to be able to find this online but definitely in store you can still find it and i think it's a must have because because it's a versatile effortlessly chic type of piece that you could totally benefit from having in your wardrobe and I, I love it I think I want to add more shades uh, let me know below what other shades you think besides neutral shades that could suit my skin tone so I can keep an eye on it and my last piece from Marquette is actually going to be an outerwear piece that I wanted for some time and it's going to be this jacket right here now i remember seeing this at the beginning of the season it retailed for 99 pounds which is not very expensive and it came i believe in three different shades and this is supposed to be an oversized coat it's not a puffer jacket i can't fully remember the name of how these are called but i'll try and put it over here if i can find it um and i adore it now it's half price at the moment i bought it in my usual size which is size 40 or 12 uk or 8 us i feel like this is going to be a product or an item better saying that i will be wearing a lot in the fall before winter kicks in with thicker knits really love the fact that it's oversized the length is also perfect i also really really like the feel of it inside it's very similar to the outside it has a pocket and it's just a piece that i know i'm going to wear a lot um, in the coming seasons because it's something that I really needed in my wardrobe. I actually want to buy something like this a lot longer um, and possibly also for market. Next I have another stories which is one of my favorite favorite stores from the high street especially in the sale season because they always always have amazing deals. I knew what I wanted to buy so I kept checking to see if it was half price or if it just had any sort of discount. So the first piece that I want to show which I'm really excited and you'll probably be surprised because I don't usually go for this style of piece but I bought an hourglass dress like this still have the tags because I actually bought this yesterday and I'm so happy that I found it in the store because I remember seeing this online in a lighter blue shade but I wanted something a little bit more neutral that could really flow with my wardrobe so it comes with tortoiseshell buttons um, it's a mini dress with a little tie at the back so definitely a different style for me but I loved the fit so this retails for 55 pounds full price but i got it for 38 so there was a 30 percent discount it's made of a cotton blend it's cotton with another fabric i think it's tensile but it also has another name before tensile so it feels very very soft i don't know if you guys can see it probably not but there is 
almost almost like a, a, a slight sheen to the fabric that makes it feel and look a little bit more luxurious now it is a mini dress but it's not too short to the point that I wouldn't feel comfortable I still think it's a very feminine although it's a very simple um, and like I said I think this is something that I will be wearing a lot with some of the shoe wear that I'm also going to show you also from in other stories so the next pieces that I'm going to show you are also from another stories and I feel like I went a little bit crazy with footwear in there but my style this year has really really been a very minimal and I wanted the barely there sandal and I feel like in other stories do them so so well at a great price so I have three pairs as I mentioned uh, one is a pair of slides and the other two are barely there sandals so the first ones that I want to show you are these ones right here which as you can see are definitely like the barely there there's only like these really thin leather straps that go over the foot and I adore these when I saw them they come in two different shades so black and a creamy shade which is very pretty these are on promotion at the moment from 65 pounds down to 39 on the website I know they're sold out but if you go into your local and other stories shop hopefully you can still find them really adore like I really adore the look of these how they fit they're super comfortable. They're like one of the most comfortable sandals I have bought in a very, very long time. They have a barely there heel, like you can barely see them. They are cushioned from here to here, like they're totally cushioned and they're super comfortable. And I love that the hardware is a beautiful, warm shade of gold, which goes with most of my jewelry. And it's my go-to type of shade when it comes to metals because it complements my skin tone. The next ones are also a barely there type of black sandal, also from another stories as mentioned. And I know you're probably thinking, Vilma, why did you buy two? I feel like these ones are a little bit different. I feel like they're a little bit more dressier because of the heel. Um, the straps are also a little bit different. The position is a little bit different. I don't know how many times I'm going to say that. But I love, love, love these ones. And the funniest thing is when I bought the other ones, these were the ones that I wanted, but they were still at full price and I didn't want to pay 65 pounds at the time. A week later, they went down from 65 to 26, which I think it's a bargain. And they still have them in store because I was there. I will link the link below if you guys want to see if on the website they're on promotion. A lot of times, and I've mentioned this before, and other stories have sales in the store, but they're not online but if you don't have a store you may have to actually purchase them online so i was true to my size in all of these that i'm showing you but like i said love these uh, the hardware is silver which is very different from what i go for but i still absolutely love these ones as well and the last footwear that i got in and other stories are these uh, brown slides i fell in love with these the moment i saw them because i was looking to replace my sandals from mango and i felt like these ones fit the bill so well they are super duper comfortable the leather is very soft again they are cushioned so they're comfortable to walk in the heel is a little block heel as you can see like super small these retail for 65 pounds they're not on promotion and they're selling really really fast so if you like the look of these you may have to just snatch them straight away um, because from what I can see on the website they are selling very very fast they only come in one shade which is a shame because I wanted something along these lines in black as well or maybe a creamy shade which I think it's gorgeous for summer I love the fact that the base of the sandal is completely brown as well because it just gives kind of like a continuous similar look all over the sandal so I'm really loving these as well so staying with footwear, the next brand that I want to talk to you guys about is Birkenstock. I've been wearing Birkenstocks for years and then I got kind of like I fell out of love with them. And this past year, I've been really, really drawn to the Arizona style. And these are the narrow fit. I got them in Arquette um, and they're made of leather. The hardware on it is completely black, which is something that I actually really prefer rather than the other ones that have 
uh, like silver or maybe gold or maybe a different shade I love the fact that it's completely black so as mentioned I got these in the narrow fit and the size that I got is size 40 they are very very true to size and if you're not aware they do come in different fits so as mentioned I got it in the narrow fit but they also have the regular fit now these retail for 70 pounds obviously depending where you buy them they are going to be at different prices you can find them at another stories office um, Arquette as mentioned and of course the original website or the official website or different online retailers um, I haven't taken the tag out I find that when I take these tags out they always stick to my foot so I decided to keep it um, I have been wearing them quite a bit they're super comfortable and I will be doing a styling video in the future with these and also so really give you a little bit more information about Birkenstocks but so far I adore them and I feel like they were a great addition to my wardrobe and my last footwear brand that I want to talk to you guys about is going to be Dune and I have these backless loafers from them from their collection of 2021 and I got them in this really nice beige shade that on camera probably looks almost like a nude shade the size that I got for these is size 41 I feel like with the backless loafers it's better to go up maybe half a size to even a size so that your heel is not hanging off the shoe because I don't find that a attractive at all and I wanted to get a pair of backless loafers because I feel for spring and summer especially if you live here in the UK where the weather is kind of like bipolar you don't know what type of shoe you're going to wear if it's not raining but it's 21 or 22 outside I feel like this type of shoe is a must-have it's effortless and it makes your outfits look a little bit more elevated even if you're just wearing jeans and a t-shirt um, really love these they retail for I think 69 pounds and they come in different different shades and different materials as well but I decided to go for the smooth leather so as my style evolves I'm also trying to be a little bit more conscious with the undergarments that I wear and I'm trying to be overall conscious with everything that I buy I try to really think about the products the fabric and how they're made and so forth so the next brand that I'm going to actually share just a little bit with you guys is going to be the organic basics brand now I'm not going to go too much into detail about them because I will be doing a full in-depth review I have been wearing their products for the past I would say maybe two three weeks and I will be doing a full review on it not sponsored but I wanted to try this particular brand for some time this is the box that the products that I have came in they come in these boxes in here so I have at least three sets that I will be sharing with you guys very very soon um, I've been really into wearing underwear that it's made of organic cotton breathable um, that it's comfortable I'm not really into the sexy underwear anymore more and I still feel that you can look sexy even more sexy if you're wearing something that really makes you confident and comfortable and I feel like organic basics is a brand that you can actually look into and see if their pieces can work for you especially if you're trying to be a little bit more conscious about what you're wearing but yeah I just wanted to show you the box um, and as I mentioned I have about three sets that I bought from them and I'll be sharing my thoughts in the near future and the last item from this video is a new handbag which has been added to my collection I have a new Pauline Paris bag this was gifted to me by the brand full disclaimer and I'm so grateful that they've reached out to me because I've been in love with Pauline Paris since I bought my uh, small nano bag in the camel shade which I've done a full review and I will link it up here so when they reached out to me I felt like I was in the clouds I felt like I was I made it in life almost it's it's pretty sad but I was really happy that they reached out because I wanted a particular bag and they were very very kind to send it across to me so their bags come in this uh, gorgeous box right here they all come really lovely and wrapped they come with paper wrap over here and then they're inside a beautiful very very luxurious 
bag. So the bag that I went for is the Pauline Paris number no. one mini in the shade Sand. I featured this bag several times in several different videos, both here on my YouTube and also on Instagram. I really adore this shade because I don't have any bags in my collection with this particular base shade. I think it's suitable for summer, spring and summer, and it's a very beautiful bag that will elevate simple dresses like the ones that I mentioned from Cause, like this one right here. It would really elevate the dress because the dress is so simple and the bag would just add that little something something to it but i will be doing an in-depth review in the future letting you know the wear and tear of the bag as well so we've reached the end of this week's video i do hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did please make sure to give this video a good good thumbs up because i always say this it really helps my channel out with the algorithm here on youtube to reach out a lot more people so they can join this platform with us Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you on my next one.